Hello everybody and welcome back to Provis Gaming and more Civilization 6 playing as Lord Salad of Arabia. We are building our first ever nuke, which we will place on a nuclear submarine. Which we did not get two of, unfortunately, either because the Venetian arsenal does not work the way I thought it did, or because, well, it processed before the Venetian arsenal was done. Either way, we're going to have to try again. But first things first, the question now becomes, do I go for a spaceport? And maybe the answer to this one is yes. Maybe it's time to finally get our first ever spaceport and start working on that. Problem is it's going to take 44 turns, which is absolutely insane to me. That is a long freaking time. It's like, I've, I'm so far freaking ahead on science, but the production just can't keep up. That's a lot of science. Oh, sorry, production. Holy crap, man. I mean, maybe at this point it really would just be faster to say, screw it, let's go conquer the world. In fact, I almost guarantee you it would be faster. I don't know. We're going to build some battleships. I'm going to test this Venetian arsenal out one more time. It only is going to take four turns to build the battleship. We'll see how that one goes. In the meantime, though, more power plants are necessary. Uh, it would take 44 turns to get one here as well. You got 45 production. That's not terrible. All right, we're going to start building our first spaceport over here, then. Build. It's going to take a long freaking time, but we're going to have to do several different uh, space missions at the same time. So maybe, just maybe, we can make that work in some way. All right, Buenos Aires is actually a Protestant. Well, that's shocking. I didn't know there was Protestant anywhere else in the world, but there is. Huh. Fascinating. Mamluk. Uh, is there another camp? I see a scout, but I don't see them... I don't see anywhere for them to go to. No, I don't think that we have to worry about that. Alright, go ahead and fortify. The Inquisitor has arrived. Uh, we'll kill these barbarians. Boom. So, can I do an Inquisitor mission from the water? Will be the next question, I suppose. I don't want to get too close where I have to engage in theological combat, but of course I know the moment I convert it, they're going to like swarm all over me again. I don't know, we're going to find out. Feeling a little bit low on the money right now. Which makes me sad. Need more housing in several places. That doesn't surprise me at all. Boom! Die scout. Uh, and you, you know what? Just sit back and heal up again. Okay, Inquisitor, go here. You can. We can remove heresy from the water. So I've done that, and now they're Islamic. So the Hindus are going to start sending me a lot of people again. Which is fine. I've got several different Inquisitorial missions to do. The more you convert, the more Islamic people I'm going to get. So joke's on you. All right, more tanks. Go there for now. Nuclear sub. This thing should be pretty darn powerful. 85 range to strength. It's pretty good. An attack range of 2. Is there anything in this game that has an attack range of 3? Because thus far I have not found it. Maybe the rocket artillery will. Uh, you want to have a bunch of my amenities and you'll give me a pittance. No, sorry. He wants to ally with me though. That's interesting. I'm not sure if I want to ally with Japan or not. It's nice having a friend, but... Oh gosh, heck no. Screw you, Gandhi. I'm not giving you all my amenities for Coco. Yeah, I don't know. Um, if I do want to conquer all their capitals, then being an ally with Japan could actually prove to be a bit of a hindrance, Satellite don't you think? No Satellites is done. Launch moon landing. Mechanized infantry. Good. Let's take a look at the tech tree. We shall go for... Ugh. I don't know. Let's go ahead and grab, um, lasers. And we'll start working toward nuclear fusion. Great scientist or spy is necessary in order to get a Eureka toward that. Nanotechnology would allow for Mars hydroponics. Do any of these have any passive bonuses I should be aware of? No, it does not appear so. Plus one gold to camps from synthetic materials for some reason. Why, because we start hunting the deer with our helicopters? I mean, that'd be kind of cool, don't get me wrong, but I don't think that's what they had in mind. Wait, we can't build Oxford? Oh, somebody beat us to freaking Oxford! I spent so long working on that. Fine, screw it. Build a spaceport instead. Alright. Down in Vilnius, get a lighthouse. Zaragoza. Uh, we don't- we do need some housing. Neighborhood is only four turns longer to get this. Build a neighborhood. 
Unit needs orders. Okay. Hey, look! Greek infantry. How you doing there, buddy? Um, I'm just going to have you go to sleep and stay here for a little bit. And what unit needs orders? You? You can heal in the water in my borders. Really? Well, that's interesting. I didn't know you could heal in the water. In your borders makes sense, but still. Pericles built Oxford. Gosh dang it. I have not been playing the Wonder game very much. Hey look, battleships. Oh, and there actually is some more Protestantism over here too. So it looks like not every city on this continent is Hindu. Most of them though, which is all that matters I suppose. This is a much more reasonable deal, I accept. You're welcome. You're welcome, sir. Even though I stole the city-state that you apparently really care about. Greece is now in the Atomic Era. Yeah, we need to get this going. Um, some wars and nuking and stuff like that before they can actually fight back. Do you want to get a spaceport in Cairo? Or do you want to get a shipyard? Okay, hang on. We actually did get two battleships. So yes, this does confirm. The Venetian arsenal does work for all cities. I just got unlucky and got my nuke sub before I could get the Venetian arsenal. So what I should have done is change production for one turn. And then came back to the nuclear subs, and that would have been worth a lot more to me. Still, though, hey, cool. Two more battleships for me. They look kind of silly and fat, don't they? Battleships are usually a little bit longer and sleeker than this, I feel like. Yeah, but I could be wrong. All right, let's go ahead and grab ourselves a spaceport here as well. Yes, I would like a spaceport. Uh, in Damietta, you have 40 production. Get a stock exchange. I need money. Get a commercial hub or a madrasa. You know what? Now, we don't need more science, though. Still, I mean, that's extra great. Scientist points and stuff, I guess. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. We can't even build walls anymore, by the way. Have you noticed this? We get into this era, and now walls are no longer important, apparently. We have just a natural defensive strength. Which is good, because why would an information-era, you know, city start building medieval walls? No good reason for that. Can we get a commercial hub worth money? Yeah, we totally can. Go ahead and start doing that. I need muns. Get me a stock exchange. You. Get me a commercial hub as well. Uh, we'll place it here, I guess. Okay. And a farm has been pillaged by... Oh my god. Hello. Geneva, apparently, spawned some bad stuff. Right. Hit the infantry. We need to get some units up here. Um, field cannon will probably be okay for now. A little worried about summoning a Mamluk against that, though. Good chance it'll die. Could upgrade it to a tank. Cost me a bit of money, though. But I think it's worth it. Hey! Knowledge of composites has advanced considerably, because we built enough tanks, apparently. Um, you just go to sleep, Mr. Siege Tower. I have no need for you. And fortify. Okay, nuclear sub, still exploring. Pericles should be on the southern end of the continent, I would guess. Just based on what I have seen thus far. Go to sleep. We can land on the Galapagos Islands? Was that what I just saw there? I think we could. Huh. Builders! And you... Can you? No, you can't. Never mind. It's just saying you can't land on it. Alright, never mind. I thought you could land on the Galapagos Islands, and I was about to say that's pretty cool. But I am wrong. Next turn. Still a lot to see, a lot to explore. Buenos Aires, one of the great merchants, right? How are we looking on great people? They've actually oh, somehow you. surpassed me. Just go straight at them. On Great Admiral Point? No, they haven't. Mine just hadn't processed yet. Never mind. Uh, we should probably recruit the general now. Rapid deployment is done. That looks. Shockingly similar to some of the aircraft that I work on for my job. Military first. 50% production towards atomic and information, melee, and ranged units. Very, very good. Alright, let's go ahead and recruit this guy. And uh, we do not need Diplomatic League anymore. So Gunboat Diplomacy is probably good to getting some extra envoys faster so I can get the uh, level 6 bonus with Buenos Aires. Anything else I care about here, though? We probably don't need Veterancy anymore. But what else would I get instead? Probably Integrated Space Race. Does, okay, Space Race Projects, that does not say that it speeds up the construction of a spaceport. So I'm actually not sure if that's necessary, but I don't need anything else right now anyway. Let's just confirm it. 
On the off chance it's actually a hidden bonus that I'm not aware of. Why, why didn't you attack? I right clicked and told you to attack. Okay. Whatever. Whatever. I'm not even mad. I don't even care, man. I don't even care. Globalization. Build three airports? Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Is there anything else here I really wanted? Four... You know what? Actually, no. Switch to collectivization. Four food from domestic trade routes. I could technically use that to speed up the growth of Guangzhou so I can build a spaceport here a little bit faster. And I definitely want a spaceport in Guangzhou because this is my highest production city. Okay. Tank, go kill. That worked pretty well. Very effective. Oh yeah. Bombard. Okay. Caravel. I guess they function as a scout now or something. We need to get some ivory online. Uh oh. There is bad stuff over here. Let's land the tank here to protect the builder. Get our ivory. Perfect. Uh, and you can attack again, apparently. So yeah, go ahead and do that. There. Problem solved. You're welcome, Geneva. Uh, battleships. And we have our general. Excellent. I guess we'll send you up here. Sure enough, there are the Hindu Inquisitors. Now, they can't do anything with these Inquisitors that I'm aware of. That only works in their own territory, their own cities. So that's a bit of a pickle for me. All right, um, I guess we should send these units to explore a little bit as well. These battleships. Nuclear sub. Still looking around. Found a tiny little island with some stone on it. Not that that's going to be much use to me. Fortify. Doop -a doop doop. Don't mind me. Just a little submarine. Nice lighthouse. I think I'll take it. It's a very nice lighthouse you have there. They got ironclads too. They got caravels, ironclads, and battleships. Hey, Greece just added on a new city, I'm but not on my ca uh, continent, so I don't I think really I care think too much. Lasers. The the future. Access to the jet fighter and the missile cruiser, which used to be an amazing ship unit in Civ Five. Let's go ahead and grab synthetic materials. We're going to need it for anything else. And it'll give me a little bit of extra gold from camps, apparently. Not that that's super duper useful, but hey, why not? Commercial hub probably makes the most sense now. So we should probably build one. I don't really want to get rid of the farm. Uh, yeah, build it here. I'm not using this tile for anything else. Okay, Mr. Inquisitor. You're just going to sit tight. Doop, 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 doop. Found another battleship. Okay. Doop, a doop, doop, doop. I think I found Greece. Tiny bit. Fortify. Kill. Thank you. This time it actually did what I told it to. Uh, what else do we want to build here? Probably should get the fish going, honestly. It's a bit of extra gold and stuff. Alternatively, the stone is kind of tempting. Stone could be good. We only have two more builds here. Probably should get the stone, though. Look at all the red hat people! Look how many Inquisitors they've sent! Jesus. Okay. Well, <laughs> that's a thing. Uh, we're going to send our general up this direction. He'll join. That'll be the next front line, almost certainly. Uh, what else to do? What else to do? I think we just have nothing to really do except for sitting back and waiting for these darn spaceports to get built. A little frustrating, not gonna lie. And get more commercial hubs so I can afford more nukes. Double scout. Claim great person. A great engineer. Alright, amenity for the city and housing. Recruit. Sure enough, there's your city. Farsalos. And you did go for some cultural buildings. It makes sense, you are Greece after all. Looks like there's another city over here. So, oh, that's an interesting place to spawn. Um... Where should we build you? Now, I'm thinking about putting an amenity wherever I'm going to make the people the happiest. And possibly here. So, 8 out of 7 amenities required makes me happy, which increases my citizen growth by 10%, and gives me plus 5% to non-food yields. If I increase that to 9 out of 7, will that make them ecstatic? It might, and we're going to try it. Transfer down to Guangzhou. We'll give it a shot. Alright, I don't need to be doing anything else in this city, so... Why don't we go spy on the Greeks? Perfect. In Barcelona. Ah, uh, 
You've got a fully upgraded industrial zone, do you? Excellent. Um, build a harbor and place it here. Yes. Okay. Doop, 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 doop. Found a settler for Norway. Some field cannons for Norway. A couple of trading posts were built in Madrid. Which is good, I guess. It should technically increase the amount of food I'm... I'm sorry, not food. Gold I'm producing. By a little bit. Okay. How much else to explore, honestly? Uh, let's go ahead and grab the stone. That's worth gold and production for me. Sana'a. And then after that, I guess we will... Pr well, we could build a farm. I mean... Eh. Mm. I don't know. If we build a fishing boat, I think I mostly will just get gold, but... Still, giving them an incentive to work this tile could be kind of good. We actually should go here to the city. Make sure they're focusing on the right things. Gonna lock this tile. And uh, I guess we will lock the production so we can get the granary a little bit faster. Yeah, okay. Next turn. I actually should get a trade route here and start doing a sea trade route. I think that will help a lot. Tonsberg. Norway expanded. Again, not on my continent, so I don't care. Why are they expanding now? Seems a bit late in the game. Oh, they built one right Class here on the T. Class struggle is done. Okay, collectivization. So if we want to pass that so our domestic trade routes start making us grow a lot faster, we could. All right, let's go ahead and do the uh, extra housing and amenity in Guangzhou. Great person activated. And I don't think it'll probably register until next turn. Yeah, 8 out of 7. It still doesn't know we have extra amenities. We'll get to that next time, I guess. Uh, let's go ahead and start working on globalization. That just makes the most sense to me. We need a bank. Actually, how much... We're actually housing capped here. We should get a neighborhood instead. Get a stock exchange. Okay, hang on. Change production. Neighborhood. Build you here. New government is available. Communism. Bonus to all production. All production. I don't know, I'm actually kind of tempted. I'm not going to lie. The only downside is we lose one wild card slot. But what would that gain me? Lose a military, which we don't need. But lose a wild card? Eh. I don't know. Um, I don't think we need it, but... It's an interesting proposition. We could switch over to a different government type. That's more appropriate for us to try and work toward the space race a little bit faster. Uh, let's go ahead and transfer you to Sana'a. You have nothing really to do. What is there, why is there a little green thing here? What does this mean for my tank? I'm not sure. I am selecting a tank, right? Yeah. I'm not sure why it had a little green highlight there. That seems a little bizarre. Okay, uh, in Mecca... Trade with... Where's better production? Madrid's a little bit faster. Go ahead and go there. Nuclear sub, still exploring. Can we go underneath the icebergs? Used to be able to do that with a submarine. Don't know if we can anymore. I'm going to send this battleship up to the north. I know there's a barbarian caravel there that I'd like to deal with. And you go here and just make sure there's nothing else we're missing. Found an encampment. This looks like India to me. Okay, so India does have a city right here as well. Again, good to know. Uh, go to the fish. Next turn. Your treasury is filling up quite nicely. It's always nice to have such a strong income, isn't it? Yes, it's only 31.9 gold per turn. That's actually the weakest I've ever been. Well, not ever, but it's pretty weak. For my modern standards. Why are the barbarians attacking my tank? They're just sacrificing themselves for no obvious reason. Synthetic materials! We can build helicopters! Fast-moving cavalry unit. Yay! Hey, look, we found the oracle. Okay, I know what I want to kill. I want to kill India and take that city. Uh, should we start working on nuclear fusion? Yes, I think we should. Send an envoy. Yay, buenos aires. Extra production for every industrial zone when building wonders districts and buildings, which actually should speed up all of my spaceports at least a little tiny bit. Done. Okay. Guangzhou. Wait, did I not activate the... Oh, you have two actions. Can I do it again? I think I can. Let's see real quick. 
It still says that they have 8 out of 7. Did I not activate you? I thought I did. Try again. It's supposed to give me an extra amenity in this city, but it doesn't say that it's doing it. Still looks like it's 8 out of 7. Did I just totally waste that unit? I might have, in which case you guys are going to get mad at me. Hey look, fish is actually worth food as well. I forgot about that. This is now a fantastic tile. Look at that. That's awesome. Alright, we're going to use Sana'a to kill. If we don't need walls anymore, that means that founding new cities is actually pretty good defense, uh, defensible right off the bat, which I do like. Kill. Okay, kill the camp. Done. Uh, we can finally trade. We shall trade with... Who's the fastest? Damietta would get us... Madrid is faster. 17 turns, 4 production. Done. Okay. Battleship. General. And sure enough, for some reason, India is unable to get to my city. I guess they don't realize they can go in the water. Actually, no, they can't get into the water, I just realized. There's a cliff here, so they can't go down here. I'm blocking the tile that has the coast. And the barbarians are stopping them from going off this direction, which is what they're trying to do. Huh. What do you know? That's kind of funny. Alright, submarine. I know I need to be ending this video, I know. You never can get enough done in one video. It's frustrating me a little bit. Okay, found another Greek city down there. This tank, just go sit in Seville for a little bit. And after this turn, we will end this video. We are a couple turns away from getting our first nuke. Who to use it on? Who to use it on? Actually, maybe I should stop with the nuclear device and wait until nuclear fusion is done. Will it automatically be a thermonuclear device? Probably not. This is probably a separate unit. We can claim a great person. A scientist. Okay, recruit. Uh, in Baghdad... We'll build a commercial hub, I think. Three science there. Or, gold. Yeah. Good enough for me. Damascus... Also could build a commercial hub. In fact, no, though, we're actually going to build some uh, traders, I think. It'll only take three turns, and that'll produce a bit more consistent money for us. Uh, we should go ahead and build the monument. Always want that. Found another city. Christiansend. Alright. Let's go ahead and uh, delay the thermonuclear device, or just the regular nuclear device, and let's see if it automatically upgrades to thermonuclear when the time comes. We do not need more housing. An aqueduct would do nothing for us. And... I could build, like, the Cristo Redentor, but why bother, really? Um... Um, 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 um... Go ahead and build another trader as well. Just switch production, it's only gonna take two turns. And here... We wanted to get some... Rainforest, yes? Most rainforests should be over here. Surrounded by five rainforests on this one tile. That should be worth about, what, 2,000 science? I think, in theory? Somewhere around there. Which is excellent. I don't know. Uh, I guess we'll find out next time. Thank you all for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe if you did. And I, as always, will see you guys next time.